I've got an unboxing video, well, kind of an unboxing video for you guys today. So this box here is from Bulk Decoy Club. I know some of you guys might not have heard about it before and they're a relatively new decoy company and I hunted over their decoys once, a couple weeks ago. And so I got me some and I want to show these to you guys because they're a little bit different and they're pretty cool. Some of you guys might have seen this on social media like Instagram or Facebook and uh, that's where I first found out about these decoys. And you can get a six pack of these Canada decoys for a hundred bucks. And so that's, that's a steal when it comes to full body goose decoys. So when they ship them to you, they come like this. They're friggin' folded up and I don't even know how many is in here. When you first get them, they come all folded up like this, which is, it's different from normal decoys. You know, normally you get your Bigfoots, your Avian X's, or whatever other decoys you use. If they're in this size of box, you're only getting like four, four to six of them. And I think there's two dozen decoys in this box right now. And what you're supposed to do is you take them out of the bag and then you stick your hand in this little hole and you just pop them into shape. And they're made out of a, a pretty durable plastic. And uh, there you go, there's your goose decoy. From what I've seen on the videos and everything, yeah, they're gonna be a little lumpy, but if you let them sit out for a while, they'll eventually take their shape or you can get like a hair dryer or put hot water on it and they'll pop right into shape. So it's pretty comparable in size to a uh, one of those Avian X's. Not like the little teeny tiny baby goose ones, but you know, pretty pretty normal. Between a lesser and a, a big decoy, you know, um, pretty average size goose. Maybe a little smaller than the geese that I shoot. I think these decoys are pretty much good all around for any type of goose hunting you're doing, whether it's for cacklers, lessers, or uh, just big honkers. I think these will get the job done. They got a flocked head and flocked tail. And they look really good, other than, you know, when you get them out of the box, they're lumpy. You just put, I'm gonna get some hot water and put it on there and try and get that to pop out. But norm, they say on their videos that if you just leave them out, they'll take their shape eventually. So that's really cool. They're super lightweight, like crazy, crazy, crazy lightweight. And that's, I like that a lot because most of the fields that I hunt, we have to carry our stuff in. And so with decoys being super light, that just makes it a lot easier. So the stakes for these decoys are pretty interesting. They're like a rubber knob on the top here. And they go up through this little hole in the bottom. And then they pop out this top hole right there. And then your decoy is in place. And it's ready to rock and roll. And when I hunted over these, these really do dance in the wind a lot more than other staked decoys like those avian x's or whatever because they're so lightweight the wind catches them and they dance really really well and you know i'm, I'm really looking forward to using these decoys uh, i think luke and i are going to go hunting tomorrow so we'll give them a shot i've got 26 of these decoys here and there's feeder heads and then there's active head. And a little bit of backstory behind this is I contacted Bulk Decoy Club and I was like, yo, I like your decoys a lot and I was wanting to know if you guys would mind supporting the channel. End deal is they sent me these decoys to uh, open up and show you guys. These these decoys, they're, they're not the ones that you would get if you went and just bought them off of Bulk Decoy Club. These are the ones that they set aside. Maybe they got like a little overspray from the flocking like on this guy, but you know, it's it's really cool to have them supporting me and doing this for me and uh, sharing. I'm really excited to share this with you guys too. But um, you know, just a little bit of flocking here and there, a little paint mismatch, whatever. You know, a goose is gonna be dead by the time it sees that. And just in my own personal opinion, you know, for me, decoys they're designed to be sold to the hunter, not to the geese you know I, I hunt geese over silhouette decoys you know they're pieces of cardboard basically painted like a goose so you know to me it, it really doesn't matter that much another thing about these decoys is they're intended to be run just like normal full bodies they sell six slot bags for them but if you guys are limited on space I know I am I've got a Toyota Tacoma and that's pretty limiting I don't have a trailer so I can't carry around all that many decoys they say that you know you can squish these down and you can fit some more in there you know they they these decoys are intended to be run just like a normal full body you know that's how it is you can't carry it around like that but if you need to you can squish it down 
and uh, fit a few more in your truck better in the back seat of your car, which I'm, I'm, I'm a huge fan of it. I'm looking forward to seeing how many of these I can fit in my truck. I'm also looking forward to um, being able to carry all these in, you know, really easy because they're light and, uh, you know, I'm kind of interested to see how many of these I can, I can carry in one hand. Let me do that real quick. So, looks like uh, six is about the max you can carry by the stakes. They do sell round bases for them. Another thing I really do like about these decoys is they sell carabiners and clips that go through this little hole on the butt of the decoy and you can clip them all together like rig em rights and carry a bunch of them with one carabiner into the field and I am going to probably end up getting some of those. Those are, those are going to be a game changer with these decoys. I really do like them. I'm looking forward to using them in the field tomorrow and for the rest of the season. And uh, if you guys want to pick some up, go over to BulkDecoyClub.com. I'll leave a link in the description of this video. But uh, yeah, that's that's it's it's cool. It is it's really really cool. But yeah, that's about it. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I'll catch you on the next one.